Monica and Rachel want to fairly divide rent in a two-bedroom apartment. The rooms have different pros and cons, one's bigger, one gets more light, and each roommate has different subjective preferences. Monica cares more about light, while Rachel cares more about closet size. How should they split the $1,000 total rent and select rooms such that each roommate is content with her room at its price? The solution is the old I cut, you choose. Monica splits the rent so that she's neutral between the two rooms, either $400 for the small room or $600 for the bigger room. She doesn't care. Then Rachel selects a room and both of them are happy. How should Joey Chandler and Ross fairly split the $1,000 total rent for their three-bedroom apartment given everyone's subjective preferences? We used a line to represent all possible divisions of rent among two rooms. For three rooms, we need a triangle. Each point in the triangle is labeled with three coordinates x, y, z, where x plus y plus z equals 1,000, and represents a division of rent. The red room costs x dollars, the green room costs y dollars, and the blue room costs z dollars. So, at the main vertices, two rooms are free. In the center, the rent is evenly divided. Each possible division of rent is represented by a single point in the triangle. Now, overlay a fine triangular grid. The finer the grid, the more accurate the results. At each point or vertex of the grid, we survey Ross. At the rent division represented by this vertex, which room do you prefer? Here, the red room is free, so it's his clear preference. Here, the green room is pricier, but he still picks it. Indicate his preference at each vertex and then fill in each small triangle with a color gradient. The colors and blends of colors indicate his varying preferences. Repeat this process for Joey. Now let's merge these. We'll average the colors. The green vertices mean Ross and Joey both selected the green room at that price division. At the purple vertex, one selected blue and one red. The ugly brownish bits where all the colors blend mean both Ross and Joey have expressed neutral preferences among several different rooms. At this price division, Chandler selects his room. Then Ross and Joey will be satisfied selecting from the remaining two rooms since they have brownish, that is neutral, preference. That's a fair division of rent. How, mathematically, do we find this special brown point? Slide each vertex to its location on this gradient. As the vertices slide, the colored triangles between them morph. Watch what happens to the center of our small brownish triangle, marked in white. It becomes the center of the big triangle. So if we play the movie in reverse and trace the white dot, or find its pre-image, then we've found a fair division of rent.